opponents, and so it's fun. Ryan, a, a huge win for you guys. Uh, it wasn't going real well in the second. You had to make some saves to hold them in there, but then they got those two big goals at the end of the period, and those are the types of goals you have to get. They were dirty goals. Yeah, you have to battle sometimes and wait for those timely goals, and uh, Paul chasing his own rebound, and, and then uh, a real dirty one there to follow it up. Uh, you know, gave us a good feeling going to third period. I thought we carried good energy from that point forward. How about Mr. Pagula coming in here? He almost seems like a kid in here when he comes in. Like, he doesn't seem like an owner. He seems like he's in awe of everything. Yeah, he's excited. <laughs> And uh, you know, you get that different perspective. Uh, you know, you get to see it from uh, a different side of things. You know, to talk to the players, get some reaction, and, uh, and be around it. It's, uh, it's definitely a good energy having him around. And it's, it's nice to see him, uh, you know, happy with the effort. And uh, you know, uh, we certainly uh, want to do it for ourselves. But you know, in the back of your mind, it, it is right there that uh, you know, that Terry came in and. Uh, you know, did a great thing by the team and, and being excited and really have, you know, supporting us and uh, you know, we want to get uh, started off on the right foot. You know, when you guys give somebody a buck or like a game MVP, they have to give a speech. Did he, did he give a good one? Oh, yeah, he was good. <laughs> you know, he, uh, he kept it together this time. Uh, <laughs> there, were, there were so many reasons to win this game. I mean, like you said, his first game and not being able to win at home. To be able to do it, it's got to be kind of nice. Yeah, it's good. Uh, I thought, <clears throat> you know, first and foremost, it is the fact that we need to clean up our game at home. And, uh, you know, a team like this, they have a lot of, uh, you know, big boys and they get the pucks in the net. So it's going to be one of those nights where you have to battle. And uh, I thought we, you know, we showed that. And, uh, you know, we did a good job getting the puck uh, moving forward. And Tyler, great individual efforts to jump up and make a great read. And that's something that, you know, I've been trying to talk with him a little bit. You know, you make a read, you commit to it, you go. Uh, and we'll get your back, and uh, you know, that was just a great play. And uh, kind of got things started, settled everybody down, and uh, settled into the battle. Really, you know, it's you know, zero zero. You got things going. You get a little bit, you know, antsy, but uh, you know, with a one nothing lead, you know, the battle. You know, the team gets it back. You know, you're not in a bad position. You, know, you just keep pushing. And uh, I thought it was great to see, uh, you know, Paul with a good effort there, and uh, and then our next line followed it right up with a great shift. I'm not used to seeing 80 shots in an NHL game. Uh, it's kind of surprising you do. <laughs> yeah, a little bit, but uh, you know, I think both teams managed it pretty well. But you know, we uh, we got loose a little bit. Two uh, you know two good bounces there in the end of the uh, second period, but uh, it was kind of one of those games where everybody was uh, you know, throwing pucks in that and, and battling and grinding, and, and, uh, and that's kind of how it goes.